In this video we will be talking about the invariant principle. Okay, uh, In math, uh, an invariant is a property of an object that is unchanged when certain transformations are being applied to the object. So, believe it or not, um, there is no more theory than this definition behind this principle, but that doesn't make the principle uh, less valuable. Okay, uh, and but so to understand this principle, let's exemplify it with a problem, a very simple problem that makes the point. All right. So the problem is this: so given an eight by eight grid, okay, um, what we do with it? We choose two opposite corners. So this corner here and this corner here, okay, and we eliminate them from the grid. Okay, so we get a shape uh, that's this original grid without these two squares. So the problem is this. Can we cover this remaining shape with two by one dominoes? Okay, without overlapping. So can we fully cover it without overlapping? Okay, uh, so if you want, maybe you can pause the video and see if we can solve the problem yourself with a clear explanation as to why it can or it cannot be done. Okay, now here's how I would uh, word a solution to this problem. All right, uh, so let's say we've got this eight by eight um, grid here. Uh, let's pretend that this is a chess table, right? So these little squares here are um, colored black and white. Okay, so if this is a white square, all right, this will also be a white square. So this remaining shape, okay, will have 32 black squares and 30 white squares. All right, because we just eliminated these two white squares. Now, what happens with the domino? One domino. Okay. No matter how we place it on this shape here, we'll cover one black square and one white square. All right. Now, what does that mean? Okay, this very simple observation means that if we place dominoes on here and those dominoes do not overlap, okay, the number of black squares is going to be equal to the number of white squares covered. All right, so the number of black squares covered is equal to the number of white squares covered. All right, so this is a crucial property of any placement of dominoes in this shape here if there is no overlapping. Well, if any uh, placement of dominoes in this shape has this property. How are we supposed to cover this shape without overlapping? How are we supposed to fully cover it? Now it becomes kind of clear that this cannot be done. So there is no covering of this shape without any overlapping with two by one dominoes. Okay. Um, now in future videos I'll come back with more meaningful problems in which the invariant principle is crucial.